Continuing in the celebration to mark Nigeria's 63rd Independence Boys Brigade, Nigeria Codensa Battalion Council, various schools in Kaduna State and youth organizations uh, tax federal and state governments to intens intensify their efforts in the fight against banditry and other forms of criminal activities in Kaduna State. They made the call at the Unity Parade in uh, Maraban, Rido, Chikung, local government area of the state to commemorate Nigeria's 63rd anniversary to showcase their patriotism to the nation, irrespective of religious, cultural difference and ethnicity as one Nigeria that is united. Plus TV news correspondent Habila Darafai filed in this report. Boys Brigade is one of the major groups that train, discipline children and youths in the fear of God to become better members of the society. Celebrating this year Independence Day, Boys Brigade members, Catholic cadets and school children came together in a march pass parade to show the power of unity and diversity as a nation. The Unity Parade revealed Officer Reverend Peter Taffa, who is the former Vice President of the Boys Brigade, Cardinal State Council, asked the government to tackle insecurity challenges before it gets out of hand. Thank God for a better Nigeria. I'm trusting God again that God should put his fear in the heart of our leaders, that they will do the right thing, especially the hardship that the nation is going through, all Nigerians are going through. Our leaders should do the right thing, that the masses of this nation will enjoy. Again, our leaders should help to fight the insecurity that we are battling with now. The thing is in the increase now. The chairman of the Boys Brigade, Kudinsa Battalion Council, Ezra Laden, says Boys Brigade has helped in shaping and instilling discipline in them to contribute in nation building, appealing to government at all levels to engage youth actively. Be part of the government. They should also give chance to the youth because they are the leaders of tomorrow. We keep saying, or they keep saying they are the leaders of tomorrow, but things have turned around. But however, we are still calling upon them that they should call and then they should make use of the youth uh, in, terms of, uh, in terms of the appointment and uh, create job for the youth, not only job for the youth, but also empower the youth. Speaking, the patron of the battalion council says discipline, loyalty and self-control is the cardinal aim of the boys' brigade, saying no nation grows when youth are not trained in the fear of God. The young ones have involved themselves in wrongdoings. So this is why, that's the reason why we are trying to see that those that are coming closer to us, we try to see them walk, uh, at least follow the footsteps of our only fathers. Also, the parade commander says there is a need for the government to wake up to its responsibilities and constitutional mandate, lamenting the rate of unemployment in the country and high cost of living in present society. We're able to get a better Nigeria. We don't know if our leaders will be able to hear our voice. This Nigeria at 63, the new governments that we are having now should be stable and be able to at least make impact on the unemployed youth that we have. Voice Brigade, we are trained towards leadership. So if we are able to get people that will connect us in the better place, we are going to make Nigeria better. We are going to move forward and make our nation. Some of the brigade members and students who participated in the parade say they are proud to be Nigerians because the nation has potential and natural resources, praying for an end of insecurity and incessant killings in the country. Nigeria has so, so many potentials country that so many people come to ask for resources to, to be used. In this insecurity time, my prayer is that I pray that God is going to bring a helper, even though, even though it's a baby, that God should bring it for so that we shall be set free. Let the country Nigeria and I will always be with Nigeria forever. And I'm proud to be in Nigeria. God guide and protect Nigeria. No evil shall befall Nigeria again. And no of us shall suffer again in Nigeria. That's my prayer for you. They offer special thanksgiving and prayers for peace, unity and progress of the nation's growth and development as one indivisible country. In attendance are boys and girls brigade, parents, Catholic cadets, various school students in Chicken local governments of the state, among others.
Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.